This is the time actually for us not to keep quiet. We have to take sides. So I'm openly taking the side of Ukraine because I can uh, listen to the Western media, I can listen to the Ukraine media, and I can listen to the uh, Russian media. I can see who is lying and who is telling the truth. Of course, this is a time actually for everyone to speak up for, for Ukraine. Otherwise, every big country is going to swallow its next door neighbor because they are not that strong. I knew that this is coming, but uh, from the bottom of my heart, I, I did not believe in that. We are friends with the, the president of Ukraine and uh, most of his team. And uh, they also, they were thinking that Russia is using all those forces around the border of Ukraine as a threat, as a card for negotiating something for them. Now it's happened. The civilians are being bombarded. The nuclear plant has been targeted. Now we are in the middle of Europe, in fact. If something happens to those uh, uh, nuclear power plant, plants, and uh, Ukraine has got uh, 15 of those, the nuclear power plant which was shelled is six times more powerful than the Chernobyl plant. The Russian equipment, I must say, they are not very precise. So they, they're sending 10 rockets in, in order to get one uh, to the destination. Do you think that Europe could do much better? It, can, it, it could, could play a better role? I think Europe has done much little than they should have done. Not only EU, but I would say America and the UK as well. They have supported all the way, first by the words, then by sending those uh, Stinger or Jubilee missiles, and that's it. The Ukrainian president was telling them that if your intelligence is telling you that the attack is imminent, then why don't you guys stop the war? Why don't you do these sanctions? When you will start those sanctions and Russians are in, in Kiev, who needs those sanctions? Ukrainians are gone. These sanctions are going to hurt Russia a lot. In 10 years' time, we will see this Ukraine is going to be the next Afghanistan for Russia. I don't know how many years they are going to be in, in Ukraine, but once they are out, they, are, they will be broken into pieces. There might be no country named as Russia, as, you, as we see the Yugoslavia today. There's no such country left with the name of Yugoslavia. 